Welcome back to Science Rocks. Earlier in the show, we talked about the Canopy Walkway at Mayaka River State Park and how it relates to what our middle school's STEM Academy students are doing. Here at Metalon Middle School, Mr. Wagner's STEM Academy students are building bridges and conducting load-bearing tests to see how their structures work. Today they're going to test their bridges. Where they're going to they're going to actually test like um, competitive bridge building, and then they're going to weigh them. They're going to see construction strengths and flaws. Um, they're going to see if they can withstand pressure and weight, integrity, um, compression, tension, load, all those te te technological terms that might drive some people crazy. Why did you decide to become a STEM Academy facilitator? Um, I love science and I love mathematics, so I thought putting the two of them together in an activity for students, hands-on, it would be awesome. Why is having a STEM Academy at your school such an important thing? Um, the biggest single thing is the diversity that it offers students in terms of choice, in terms of the ability to experience real world events, and also for them to begin to think as to what the future might look like for them. This gives them an opportunity to actually flex their minds, use their hands, and combine their creativity with some of the ideas that they have. So I think it's very, very important. It gives me that breadth of academic experiences that should be attractive to um, high-functioning kids, medium-functioning kids, and even low-functioning kids, because oftentimes we find the low-functioning kids don't grasp the academic material without seeing that tangible, hands-on relationship. So from all perspectives, I think it is very important that we have a STEM-type academy to um, uh, help our students in their learning. Why did you decide to become a STEM Academy student? Um, I wanted to find out ways to build up to my career and to um, know the right path to succeed. This is an after-school academy. How does it connect to the math and science courses that you're taking during the school day? Um, I guess it can connect because it teaches us ways to like stay focused and ways to overcome obstacles, stuff like that. Why did you decide to become a STEM Academy student? Well, because I wanted something to do after school and I just like the structural design of doing stuff and engineering. What have you been learning about the design process of STEM? Well, that usually triangles are a lot more structurally sound and then rectangles and also sometimes you use your terrain to your advantage. So as you can see, our students are learning complex engineering skills in our STEM academies. And we'll continue to show you how Pinellas County students are taking STEM education to the next level. That's our show for today, and we'll see you next time.